Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Morrowind. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it's just to join me today here next to Caldera. Look how beautiful it is. Caldera is a really pretty city, uh, or town rather. It's a mining town, and we're here because we came here to kill a few Talvani agents, but we're not gonna kill them right away. Last episode we got a quest from uh, that lady over there. You might not be able to see her. She's right there. Uh, she apparently has been robbed by some notorious thieves to the east of Caldera. Uh, and uh, we're gonna take care of that at the beginning of this episode, but first we're gonna go into that tomb right there I also picked clean this this wall very green and very fertile land uh, next to uh, to Caldera as I said last episode It's very easy to miss that little part patch of, of things on that side So I'm gonna heal myself. Oh, I have the world map here. Don't need that. Okay. Let's go with Bane's efficacious uh, balm see what I can do here and Oh, that was a bad roll at the end. And there we go. Okay, good. And I'm good to go. Let's let's see what we have here waiting for us. Oh, I thought the, the soundtrack was going to change. Let's find out. This is not trapped. Hello. We have a hunger. He's dead. Hungers are not very powerful. They don't have a very powerful soul. Uh, so I didn't bother getting it getting that, but we might find some Atronax or something like that in here if we're finding hungers already. Actually, the north, the farther north you north you go, you I think, it might be confirmation bias, but I think you have a higher chance of finding weird, even if it's low level, but weird uh, uh, enemies like less skeletons and more demonic things. Uh, so that hunger is now no longer hungry. Okay, I don't really know why it's called the hunger. It's gotta be. It's it's gotta it's gotta have nothing to do at all with hunger, hungerness or hunger in general. But yeah, the book of dawn and dusk. Don't need to know that. That's about Azura and it's. Oh, oh crap. Oh crap. You guys know what that is, of course. He didn't see me. Might be able to do something here. Nope, didn't work. That thing has AOE. I'm gonna die. Wow. Damn it! These I I shouldn't be sneaking. I should I should have stopped sneaking and I should do. Actually, it's very easy to kill that guy. I I I screwed up there. I screwed up there. Sorry, sorry. Oh no! The game crashed for me. Huh? I'll be right back. And right back I am. And there's a hunger here. It's gonna die. There we go. Just take care of him. See if we find something new and interesting in here or something. I don't know, but probably not. Oh, we cast something on me. What is that? What is that? Tell me. Tell me what that is. The night eye. Oh, that's me. That's that's my that's my own cast. So yeah, there is a very easy way to get that uh, that uh, Deidroth. Well, I say very easy, but it might not be that easy. I guess we'll find out. So if he doesn't come this way, I think he since we since I loaded the game inside, uh, we might be in for the same exact. Thing that we got before so let's go ahead and okay so he's there no that's the okay get this stuff let's wait for the guy he's still in the same patrol route so the idea here is to just stick to the wall and walk left because you'll see if I walk left right like so the guy is gonna think that I'm going left and he's gonna fire to the left yeah I can be duped like that uh, and in the name of not hello I can do it from here as well in the name oh no he doesn't Oh, that's good. No, that's not good. I'm gonna die again. <sighs> Please don't crash again, game. I have no idea why the game crashed. You didn't see the... I don't know if you heard the plink, if there was a, a plink, but it just appeared. The, the the software stopped working or whatever. So the guy's gonna stay down there. I might, I might benefit from storming him. Oh, like this. Oh, like this. He's stunned. Oh, he's died. He's dead. Okay. Oh, yeah. You, you growl however you like, but you're still gonna die. Oh, we have one of these. No, oh, these guys are fine. Clan fears. Uh, I can't cast spells here because I can't be bothered. I can't. I can't actually. Let's do that. Crap. He saw me. He's gonna have see He didn't see me? Oh, nice. Nice. I got him. I no, I didn't. Oh, I'm still gonna survive. Woo! I think. Yeah. Holy. 
Holy crap, that, that noise lasted forever. You have a key here. I don't need that key. That's a weird key, but I don't need it. Uh, failed that spell. Okay. Uh, we got some uh, Daedra skin. That's okay. I could have gotten his stuff as well. These guys are pretty powerful. Uh, but yeah, it's it's better to survive. We're still... We're, we're hand, well, the game's not easy. The game's not easy at this point. We are going... We're doing things a little bit more brusquely than we probably could have. But, you know, I mean, what I mean is we're kind of advancing onto content that might be a little bit gated so, so far. These guys are being pretty tough on us. But also the fact that we haven't been developing any sort of uh, resistance in life and just health. That, that also plays against us for sure. Uh, that's definitely the biggest difficulty thing going on. Yeah, I think our armor kind of gave us a little bit of security early on, but I think it's, ca it's ca catching up to us or something. It's got some bloat, some Ifa, say of Fafaya, Got a skull there, these are the spirits. That thing is trapped, let me take care of that. So what I want, but sure. It's free, so go ahead. What do we have here? One meager gold. Yeah, lovely, lovely, lovely. I don't need to sneak anymore. We have some stuff over here, some stuff over there as well. I open it and I then I move. Oh, look at this, look at this. I'm gonna open it, Whee! and I'm far away when it finally opens. It still works, although uh, it might crash the game. I think it crashes the game if you do it a little bit too much. Oh, crap. Something over there. It's uh, I, I, by the hand, it doesn't look like a Bone Lord, but it could be. Yeah, it's a Bone Lord. Hopefully a greater one. Greater ones are pretty good for the souls. But it's not. not right? Go die! Yeah, it's just a normal one. Um, the greater ones have uh, have uh, a soul. If you trap them, you can get a nice money out of that one. I think we have a greater Bone Lord sword. So a soul somewhere. Not really sure. Got a flower here. People were giving offers to these. I they I'm not really sure how this works. So, ba do, do the owners of, of these, the owners of these, uh, of these, like the families of this, of, of these tombs, come here and give these offerings? And do the Daedra not not bother them? I mean, the ghosts I can see that work, but the Daedra not killing the people? Oh no no, I, I'm the family. Oh oh, well, by all means then, but just go out right ahead. I'm not really sure how that would work, but maybe it's not supposed to work at all. Maybe just people just don't come here anymore. Although all the fires being lit, that kind of doesn't explain that too well. But anyway, we're going to the east of Balmora before we're going, we're going to Balmora itself. Did I pick all of this? I did. So, to the east it is. Actually, there's a big gash here. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna leave this region pretty soon, if I can make my way up here. I could, I could drink a levitation potion. That would also work. That might be what I'm about to do. Yeah, that's what, I guess, that's what I'm gonna do here. So climb up here. We might be able to glitch our way. Yeah, this. Oh, night time. Let's go this way. It's better. And I wasn't jumping either. So, and here we are, with a cliff racer, of course. These guys are everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. There's not a single region in the in the world of Vanderfell. Oh, it was blighted. They don't catch it though. Um, not a single region that doesn't have cliff racers. Every single one. Only the expansions don't have them. And they have their own sort of things. Soul's theme has some boars, and uh, they're pretty common, unfortunately. And uh, uh, the Tribunal Expansion, I don't remember what it has. Tribunal Expansion is different. I really, really like it. I can't, I can't wait until we go there and show you guys. Oh, I think we are at a spot, but I don't think it is the right spot. Let's murder this guy so he doesn't bother us on our way out. And we can actually sleep here. I'm going to dispose of the corpse, even though that's not actually beneficial to me. What is that green stuff? There's nobody over there. Okay, we're good. Let's rest just to bring up our stamina. And then we're going to sneak into this place and see if this is indeed the place we want to go. Abaelum Mine. Hmm. Abaelun. It's a mine. Could be a... Actually, I think it might very well be a, a, a Kwame Mine. It isn't. Oh. We're fine. We're free. It's good. Hey, man. What's up? Hello. I'm an officer of the Imperial Legion, so tell me about you. He's just a guard. Tell me about this place. Uh, at first it seemed then that the Nerevarin things and whatnot. So this mine is, I believe, a diamond mine. Look at that. You can take them if you want, but they're gonna attack you. Uh, you're in a diamond mine, says this guy. Don't touch the diamonds or the guards will kill you. Yeah, well, they won't, but I'm mean, actually, they might. They might. They're pretty powerful, these guards. 
Uh, if you are high level, you should be able to handle them easily enough, or if you have special items. But otherwise, I'd recommend you don't touch anything in here. It's an interesting, it's a really interesting piece of world building here that uh, Skyrim has this sort of mines here. They, they don't, they're not connected with anything. They're just mines. They're just another location, another sort of location. So you have the uh, the Age of Shrines, you have the Dwemer Ruins, you have the Grotos, you have all sorts of stuff. And you also have Diamond Mines and Ebony Mines and all this sort of stuff that some of them are occupied, some are not. You have the Quama Forage Mines or whatever, Quama Mines. Uh, and it's pretty pretty awesome that they do that because because it really I don't know it builds the world which is it makes it it makes it deep you know makes it interesting because it makes sense I mean after all the Imperials are occupying this place and they let me see if I can kill this guy oh he's falling I know, not fall, falling is not probably not the word but he's dead that's what he is uh, and yes so I'm gonna take that from you and I'll say goodbye because we have think what we're looking for. Oh, we have a rat as well. I wasn't looking for that. Let me get this. And that. Okay. Let's get the rat as well. What the hell are... There it is. Get that. No disease. Oh, I got a disease. Dang it. It's uh, Ash Cancer. Again. I think it is... Uh, I think I might be able to cast the... Uh... No, I might... Do I have the cure... Do I have a cure... thing? Cure blight disease on self. 0% chance to cast. Yeah. Okay, forget about that. Let's cast the uh, the cure, not the, the what's the cure realm's cure. Yeah, let's let's cast that one. I don't think it will work. Yeah, it doesn't. So I'm gonna need my potion that I have brought just for this occasion, and there it is. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, let's get in here. I know you can't see anything. Shushishi, Shushishi is the name of this place. I can't really see anything. I'm probably gonna go. Let's cast this. We got ogres. I think they're they're aggressive, yeah. Okay, so I'm probably gonna are they all aggressive? <laughs> Fight like a child. Well, it's it takes pretty a pretty good amount of strength to operate a a longbow, so I don't know. Would the child be able to operate a longbow? A short blow, bow perhaps, but definitely not with definitely not with enough strength to kill you. What do you have there? That's a last right called thing. Uh, the fire damage. Oh, it was a good thing. It was a good thing I didn't didn't get striked by that, because my health is 94. Okay, that guy's still aggressive. I think there's one guy in here that's not aggressive. Ouch! Can't see you. Can you please die? Ouch! Okay, thank you. Let's cast that so we can see. Also cast the. Efficacious Balm, because I think I took too much damage. Was it from her? Was, was it? Did I have that before? Did I not heal before I got in here? I don't know. She didn't have a magical hammer. Let's see what she had. Steel War Hammer. Okay, so you keep that one in your death when she despawns. Uh, okay, so let's continue. We still have enemies. I believe, I believe that all of them are enemies. If I remember correctly, all of them are enemies except for the last one. Or that one. I don't know. Let's fight this guy, Dagger. Getting sneaks, so... Hey. He knows I'm here. He's looking at me. Oh, no, he's not. Give Was... in. You're dead nope. already. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> what did you Ooh. cast? I don't know. But we're good. So, yeah, you need to be careful because you might inadvertently kill one of the guys that you don't want to kill. Well, you might want to. You, that's an easy way to complete the quest. And, uh, yeah, so we're in the right place. I, I forgot to sh look you, uh, show you on the map. Well, it is east of Caldera, so we might not be in the right place. Maybe we are. I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, let's get the, gay, the crate. What we have here is a greatest soul gem that I'll take and a grand soul gem that I'll take as well. Soul trap as well. Mm -hmm, good stuff. Good stuff. It's been a while since we've been in a place like this with all this nice stuff to look at. Yeah, it's getting... Okay, I'm not going to take those because as expensive as they are, I don't really need them. Uh, let's take just some money. It's all fine. These pickaxes are not needed for anything. And can I sleep? I cannot. So there's still an enemy somewhere around here, and I'm gonna. Can I? What? What? Come on. Okay, good. And they have slaves. I have the key for these slaves. So let's. Oh, that's trapped. Be careful with that. Let's get the probe out. There we go. And. Hello. Why do you approach? Because I have the key, man. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. I was stealing from him. Yeah, go free, man. Unlock. There we go. You as well. Uh, t t they have all different names, and I 
can't be bothered to read them because they're weird names. So they're together here. Go away, man. And woman. Uh, okay, so we have another guy that's probably going to be aggressive. Here it comes. What? Your spear? Your spear is nothing. Look at my dagger. Mm. Oh, she, she likes my dagger. She That sounded... Mm. Uh, okay, so we got a silver spear. Actually, it's a nice spear. I like your spear. Uh, but not enough to moan like you did. And uh, we don't have any more enemies. Which means that the last guy... Oh, no, we do. Let's be careful. There's lava. I don't want to jump over there right now. I think I'm going to go this way. Let's cast that spell again so I can see. Yeah, I think he's going to be here. Yeah, so that guy is not aggressive. And you can talk to him. But it's easy. It's very easy to just go up to him. Especially if you're sneaking. To go up to him and kill him right away. Uh, because you think he's going to be aggressive. Don't. Don't do that. I mean, do that. It's fine. But if you don't, well, you get a little bit more dialogue. And a different way to complete that quest. Which is interesting. Uh, oh, it's a Khajiit. Khajiit. Oh, that's right. It was called Drazarir or something. Draw zero. Why do you approach? What do you want? He asks. Well, family heirlooms. Heirlooms? Ah, Drozir has found plenty of heirlooms. They seem just to fall into his pockets. In fact, Drozir just found a few new pieces earlier today. Took them from some Nord woman. Cried like a baby, she did. How am I a pressure jewelry? Well, you met her, huh? Well, what was that? What has that got to do with Drozir? Drozir is in this for the cash, not for some ridiculous sentiment. No more to say to you, unless you've got a better offer. Well, um... I just want the jewels. Nothing else to say? Then, as far as I'm concerned, you're just another victim trespassing on my property. You'd better leave now. Okay, he doesn't like me too much. Let's ad admire him. Let's see, if, let's see if I can intimidate him. No, I can't at this point. I could probably hope to admire him. He doesn't like me at all. And then intimidate him after I admire him. If that, if I get lucky, that will work. But admiring him is not going to do anything here. Uh, I, I could give him money. Hmm. That's not gonna work. Yeah. He's gonna attack me though, I think. No, he doesn't. Okay, so I have a fix for that. Don't look at me. Seriously, don't look at me. I wanna steal from you. Okay, I'm sneaking here. Can't. 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 Come on. It's murder. And down he goes. That's what you get for being a dumbass and not taking my admiration. And we got an expensive ring, we have an expensive amulet, and that is what we wanted. We also have a demon ta tanto uh, that we don't need, but I'm going to leave down there for some reason or other. So yeah, let's continue going around. We have more slaves down here. Yep, that's part of the reason why you want to kill that guy, because he's a slaver. Although you might just want to take... You, you can pay him for... I think he, uh, he accepts money if you give him the money for the amulets. That's one way to complete that quest. I was going to do that, because that's kind of like being a thief a little bit before me I mean merchantile and all that sort of stuff it's that's part of a thief and that's part of my skills as well I think uh, did I pick that one up I didn't actually tell me why did I bring illusion why did I br uh, because of charm yeah that's right uh, yeah I say merchantile but it's mercantile so let's go to the other side of this ravine uh, we oh we're good oh lights were out right as we landed and let's find out what is in here with my bow. It's a nice looking bow. But whatever's in here. There was a, there were enemies. I remember there being enemies. What kind of enemies were there? I saw that. There there they are. They gotta be somewhere around. Forget about that. That's, they're not gonna detect me too too easily. So let's just go around here. Got a few. There they are. See? It didn't detect me. Oh, one shot kill. It's fine. Okay, and it is a shulk with some shulk resin that we're gonna take, of course. And uh, there's nothing real. I think now it's free. The mine is empty of enemies. I don't really know how this connects back to where we came from, but even oh, more lava. I can't. Oh, there's gonna be enemies somewhere around here. Probably more shulk. Oh, I remember this place actually. Okay, this is a little bit risky. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think it was a good thing that we didn't use. We, yeah, that we didn't use the uh, levitation potion because there's a way to go somewhere. I think here uh, with the levitation potion. Oh, I have two, so it wouldn't be too much of a problem. We got the storm elm. That's an interesting item. What is that? Flame bolt. I don't need that. 
It's just a bunch of flame bolts. Okay, don't need bolts. Imperial Newt, Newt Scale Cures. And over here we have Frost Shield. It's a quality one, so I'm gonna take it. And uh, everything else is not really needed. I don't really know how I came to die there, but he did. Oh, wait a minute. I think you need levitation to get out of here. Is that what it was? Do I need levitation to go around? Yeah, I did. I do. Eh, I might be able to jump up there. Let's not use the levitation if I can avoid it. We Nope, I'm good. Ouch, ouch. 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 Ouch, ouch. Okay. Forget about that. Take the levitation. There's no, no way out. Okay. I took a little bit of damage, but that's all fine. Let's uh, jump, jump ahead. Oh. I don't know where I am. Okay, I'm here. Good. Let's go around. There is no escape. Well, there is, especially if you levitate. Oh, she doesn't know what to do. Poor little girl. Poor little redhead girl. Ugh. Look at that aura below us. Yeah, that's the aura of levitation. It's gone. There we go. And she had a master's probe and a journeyman lockpick, uh, lockpick, and uh, that's good. Oh, this. Oh, so that's where we are. She wasn't a bow woman. Dumbass. She shouldn't have been. She should have shot me from up there. If she had been not, if she hadn't been sleeping on a job, because she was obviously. So we're up out here again, and actually we're very close to the ghost fence. D have you guys seen the ghost fence? I don't think we have. So, let's go there. Let's go up here and look at the ghost fence. So the ghost fence is basically a fence. Oh, we're not that close. Not as close as I thought. So let's not go there. Let's not go. Oh, I was going to avoid you, little guy. You're dead. You can complain all you like, but you're still dead. And we have some fire things down there. Fire root or something. I'd also like to sleep if I can, but I can't. There's an enemy somewhere around here or something. There's a shulk. No, there's a rat. What is this? Fire fern. Fire fern. Fire fern. Okay, take those. Get that. It's a bunch of stuff here to collect. Trimer roots and all that sort of stuff. Where the hell is that rat? Where did he go? Did he die or something? He might have. You never know what happens with these guys. He, I think he might have... No, I'm still being attacked by him. It's just the soundtrack is a little bit crazy. Okay. There's another one attacking me right now. I saw you. I heard you, actually. So you guys are all dead. I didn't contract a disease from that. And I didn't contract a disease from this either. It's good. It's good. Let's get whatever is in here. Ooh, what is What is this big thing? Bitter green plant. Didn't have anything for us. A bunch of other stuff here. These don't have anything. These are good. And that's going to come with us. Ooh, nice. More of these. And the amount of potions I'm going to make and the amount of money I'm going to make as well. Oh, hi! Is that other one pursuing me as well? I can take a I can take an arrow to him. Let's see that. Oh, that's the ghost fence, by the way. That thing is over there. Yeah, I think we're going there. Let's see if I can kill that guy. Oh, I had to lead him. Didn't work. There's two of them pursuing me. Dang it. I got one. And I yeah, well, I hit the other one. I didn't, but he avoided. Oh, he's blighted. He is blighted, dang guy. Oh, he's good. He's good. He's good. Okay, so he's gonna die nonetheless. And he's dead. Okay. What's that sound? I heard something like a volcano going off or something. But I don't know what it was. Okay, let's go up here. Let's look at the ghost fence. Actually, some of these paths uh, up the mountain, some of them don't have connections to the interior of the ghost fence. Hello. Uh, so you might want to explore, like for example, this one actually does, I remember this one. Uh, we're actually very close to the gate of the ghost's fence, the ghost gate is the name of the gate. Uh, but we're gonna explore that mine over there, hopefully it's an interesting mine, but I, I wouldn't count on it. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Okay, and the diseased rat didn't give me a disease, and we're good to go, let's get these tramer roots and let's see what we have in here. Actually, before I do that, yeah, it's a mine. Uh, let's look at the ghost fence a little bit better, let's go up here, on our way back we're gonna visit that mine. Uh, but well, we're still being attacked. But that doesn't really matter. I think it might be the guys ahead of us. Oh, of course, it's these guys. Oh, there's, there's too many of these. There's three of them. Hey, guy. Do you want to die? Are you lighted or something? No. I didn't get the other guys, by the way, I, th I don't think. The guys that I killed uh, while they were flying. I, I think I forgot about them or something, but it doesn't matter. So, yeah. 
the ghost the ghost fence basically meant to keep out the blight keep out the enemies as well there's there's nasty things in there and as soon as you get in there you start to see very very fast actually you can find them outside uh, because the, the game works uh, in a specific way uh, you can find sometimes the enemies that are in there you can find them outside but I wanted to look in there because we haven't found anything here yeah I think we're gonna be able to go right up against the fence and look in there and see so this goes you can see this connects yeah so I, I know yeah we're very close to the ghost gate we could, we could probably go there didn't we learn about somebody that was in there and there's a mine right there oh I remember this place I remember this place you can't go in it's a impassable passage there's things in there it's just a cliff racer it's all fine there's things you can look at and actually you can jump over the cliff the it's an ash slave he doesn't attack me because he can't see me because the ghost fence works as a wall but he's an ash slave yeah you can you can ash slave ash slave I mean uh, yeah so they're um, they're in there it's that sort of enemies that are in there that guy's gonna see me isn't he does he see me vertically no he's going away awesome okay are we s yeah we're running let's go to the ghost gate because it's a pretty inter oh, man from caldera to the ghost gate I just can't keep I can't keep to a to a thing just going around showing you guys things and seeing cool things if I were playing by myself I'd be playing a little bit differently because despite me wanting to see things I can I can delay that but uh, showing you is a different thing showing you cool things is a different totally different thing so just picking up these and of course we still need to come up this way what is that Let's see if I can kill that guy up there probably won't be able to and I'm gonna oh no he's run away what is that thing oh I know what that is I know what that is it's our first encounter with that thing let's find out what that is uh, what you saw there was just uh, an artifact and that's the ghost right the ghost gate right there let's approach peacefully hello guys how's it going hey so these guys are Ashlanders hello this is ghost gate he who watches and my name is Zalit Ashastalaisvara let me know if you need any information okay rumors uh, have you noticed for all its proclamations yes I have what about training? He's a trainer, okay. So what about Ashlanders? Can you tell me about your, yourselves? The Ashlanders were worship their ancestors. Maybe he's not an Ashlander though. What do you want? Do you want something? Yes, tell me who you are. She is a wise woman and initiate of the Ashlanders. So she is indeed one of the Ashlanders and he is, who are you? He is a scout with a weird name. And the sun is rising, oh my God. You see how pretty that was? Yeah. Sun is rising over the mountain. This is trapped, and I might be able to get in it without much problem. I'm gonna save the game here, even though I'm quite tired. I'm actually gonna. Oh, there's enemies nearby. Okay, I, I can fix that with my sword, with my dagger. I mean, open that and see what we have. We have some gold. Okay, it's all fine. I don't need the, that amount of gold, but yeah, the sun is rising. Let's go to the ghost gate. So to get through the ghost gate, it's all very easy. All you need to do is to click this thing. And let's do that, actually. I think I see something. Oh, I don't see anything on the other side. Just click that thing. It opens. It's very much like going under the wall of, uh, of A Song of Ice and Fire. Switch that. And no, you need to click this one. And that will close. And this one opens. And we have an Ash Slave up there. Already. And he's got the same old, same old ability to shoot those things. As always. Just going to deplete his mana. Wee! I jumped out of it. <laughs> yeah. Jumped out of the way for that one. Actually, I'm getting tired of this stuff. Oh. I got him. I got him there. I'm gonna kill him with that arrow and marksmanship. Oh, I failed. So what you're seeing right now... Oh, he's coming. There we go. So this is a Nash slave. There it is. So what you're seeing right now... As soon as we enter through the ghost gate, is a blight storm. And look at this. I mean, actually, yeah, look at this. You can see. It's got a pretty cool animation that, uh, oh boy. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. It was pretty outside. And basically, it's very easy to get through, but the guys don't have the smarts to do that. So they don't do, they don't do that, and the gates close automatically. And out here, this thing goes away. It just takes a little while to, for it to go away, but it does go away, I think. Ready to... Yeah, there it is. It's going away now. You can see. You can start to see the things. It just takes a little while. It's the it's the way the engine works. 
But we are out of time for the day, so before we get in there and do a whole bunch of things that we still need to do before we go to Caldera, I'm gonna have to end the episode. I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Morrowind. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video, but above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.